I wish I had a lot of different people. I think I have mentors, you know, on screen and in books that I I look at, but no, I don't it's a have bit a... It's different now than how it used to be with mentors, yeah. isn't it? Have you ever sent a sext to anyone? Oh, well, yeah, a couple of... Well, I don't know how sexy they are, actually, right. but they're my attempt. What is your attempt? Wang. I can't even remember, but I'm always too frightened the children are going to find it because Emily's picking up the oh, phones. Yes. I, so I, I kind of always bail a little bit. Oh my God, I could never... I would wish I could. Like if I sent something to Sam now, he'd be like, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> yeah, totally. Stop Put that. some clothes on. <laughs> Come on. Okay, on a scale of one to ten, how high maintenance are you? I'm a two. I'm yeah. the easiest person to work with. I'm the least fuss on set. That sort of person, yes. But high maintenance in terms of, Wayne, we should do a show. How about we do this? What if we do that? Yeah. Why don't you go and I'm that on that of servicing my yes. needs? You're high. <laughs> I'm high. Yeah. <laughs> um, what was the last lie that you told? It could have been last night to someone that I was talking to that I said, I've just got to find out where that guy that I was... Because I need to, because he was... To get away. Yeah. It's so obvious. That is, I'm the worst at it. Same. But what are your excuses? I'm, I'm just going to get a drink. I'm just going to go to the toilet. Like, how many times can you go to the toilet? when I? And it's so obvious. And sometimes when people do it to me, I go, oh my God, they were trying to get out of that combo. <laughs> what was your first job? <laughs> uh, check out chick wool Woolies. Oh. Yeah. Um, what do you do to relax? Uh, cook. Do you? Yeah, yeah, I love cooking. Right. Okay, well this goes to our next question. What's your go-to dish at a dinner party? I, I'm quite famous for my chicken pies. Like if I've got oh. a lot of people, like if I've got a big do, Melbourne Cup or something, you know, 25 yeah. people, chicken pies. Really? I'm very good at the chicken pies. Okay. Yeah. Um, what celebrity would you most like to be besties with? Meryl Streep. Yeah. Meryl Streep. Do you know Streep. what? I met her once. Shut. Yep. Oh, this is over. Oh, this is it was really awful. Why? So she came out for, well, I forget what movie, Mamma Mia. She came out for Mamma Mia and I was on that full line, like, of press. It was my first radio show with Ryan Shelton. And we had one question to ask her. And I said, oh, which a million people would have asked her because she played that dingo took me baby. Oh, yeah, yeah. Years and years ago. Yeah. So she can do an Australian <laughs> accent. So I said, oh, I heard you can do an Australian accent. And she went like this, touched my face rubbed my face and just did a, a quick American accent and then moved on. But it was so motherly and beautiful. She could see I had no idea what I was doing and so we're best friends. That I can introduce so, you. Please do, because I love everything about her. Yeah, she's pretty special. Mm. I'll, I'll tell you more about her Thank later. <laughs> <laughs> Person living or dead you'd most like to have... <laughs> Don't, I haven't watched that, that face, now you just fucking touched it, now I've got you on me. <laughs> um, person living or dead you'd most like to have dinner with? Look, I'd love George and Amal over. Oh. I'd be really intimidated. I think I'd be too scared to speak. They would not want to eat your chicken pie, I don't think. No, I'd have, no, I'd make a proper, I'd do something better for them. Stephen Colbert? This is expanding out. This is the, I could do chicken pies because it could be a few people. Okay, okay. Stephen Colbert? Okay. Jamie Oliver? Oh. Boring, why? He's just changed the world. Okay. I shouldn't say boring because he's great, but like too accessible. Just turn on your TV and he's there. Yeah, I do feel like I know him. Yeah. 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 <laughs> have, enough. have you ever stolen anything? Mm. Woolies. Oh, yeah. There. It's the only time. No, no. I actually didn't. I, I, there, we had to play a um, cassette of music, you know, for the store oh. and it came from the, you know, the what was selling at the time and Herman's Hermits, the collection of Herman's Hermits. I have no <laughs> idea what you're talking about. <laughs> Just nod, doesn't okay. matter. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> the point is it was playing and I loved it and it wasn't part of the stock because it was in the, you play the music. Right. And I, and I thought, if I could just slip that into my uniform pocket, I could take that home. So I slipped it into my pocket and felt really guilty and took it out. Did I, you? You yeah, couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. I'm way too Catholic. Um, what are you afraid of? Well, I'm, I'm highly anxious. I've suffered anxiety for a long time. So I, get, I have frightened feelings about really stupid things which I've tried to work through, but 
um, electric fans. Oh, These I was things. not expecting you to say yeah. that. Yeah. Really? Yeah, I'm better now. I'm better now. I've worked through it. Bit of wow. cognitive. But yeah, dumb, dumb things that ignite that anxiety. Funny? Yeah. Anything else? Swings for a while. Oh, I, I got know. used to that. I had two with children. Laugh. <laughs> this is like <laughs> that shit crazy. I know, it's stuff. totally crazy. <laughs> totally crazy. Yeah, wow. I, I've had panic attacks for a long time. Not anymore. I'm, I'm kind of over it. But yeah, dumb, dumb things. Wow.